How's everybody doing? I hope you're all doing well. I was going to go and make a long video, but I'm just going to give you the information. You can check it out for yourself. You can go over it. Um, I made ten, plenty of videos on all this stuff. The sun's been blank. It's been quiet. The sun erupted on the far side like I've been talking about. This was uh, yesterday. This is yesterday, so I'm going to get rid of it because there's a new one today. This is what we have to be worrying about because this is the kill shot. I know about, I'm going to talk about the eruption, but uh, I'm not going to go over it right here yet. This is the most important. As I said, 27 days right here. 27 days, this is the 23rd, right here, this right here, Feast of, or Tabernacles, Tabernacles right here, full moon, I will go over the eruption too right now, so right here, this is the eruption, this is when we're going to get hit, right here, this was just today, Spectacular solar flare erupted from the sun. Old region is it back, getting ready strong flares. This is exactly what I've been talking about. This is the strong where the strong eruptions happened. He even states it right here, I will show you. Class C. M class right there. He put this out today. It's going away from Earth, but it's turning around, coming our way. Right here you can see he's got the timestamp. 917, right here. It's turning around, coming earth facing. So he's he's expecting the it to come around as I showed you in this graph right here. He knows it too, because he's been watching this too. He's he's the best one right here. He, Nemesis Maturity, he's the best one. He he tells you where it's located. He says, yeah, there was a solar flare, but it was behind us. It's coming around. It's going to be here. It's going to be here, here. And it's going to be on the full moon. It's going to be the 23rd, right in here. It's coming. See, fr Friday, right here. It's going to be coming earth facing right here, the 23rd, right here. Just what we're looking at, the 21st to the 23rd, which is only one, two, three, three, four days away, five days away. Just what we're looking at. So, I want to give you an update on this. Yes, it's coming around.
you'll get a better look in the next 48 hours because it's coming around. So, as I show you here, if you want to look at it, this is the best information right here. Now let's go over this right here. This hurricane is in the Bible, okay? As hurricanes are in the Bible, and I've had plenty of videos on that in the past. Most people have been know what I'm talking about. This hurricane is coming from right where the volcano is going off, okay? Right where the volcano is going off. That's that's where it's coming from, okay? Full moons and tidal eruptions. Full moon and tidal eruptions. You can check this stuff out for yourself. It's three three point five days roughly. Three point five days. Three point five days from a full moon or a new moon. Three point five days. Behave. This is all 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 eruptions. You can check this out for yourself. Full moons and tidal eruptions. Full moon and tidal eruptions. Eruptions happen 3.5 days the big from a full moon. So right here on the full moon, 3.5 days, 3.5 days tidal eruptions right here. Right what we're looking at. Also significance with this is that we're going to have some big solar flares at this time also. We're going to have some big solar flares at this time also. So, I didn't know if you knew, but this is also... CNN reports satellite images show Russia seems to be preparing to test fire another one of its nuclear-powered cruise missiles. This comes just months after CNN reported on Russia's testing of a doomsday drone that's designed to cause massive tsunamis filled with radioactive material. The nuclear-powered missiles, codenamed Skyfall, are around 8 meters long and feature nuclear engines which allow them to fly incredibly long distances. Russia claims the missile can take any route to its target, and the U.S. says it's designed specifically to get around U.S. air defenses. In April, CNN reported on Russian tests of its new Poseidon 2M39 drone torpedo. Unlike conventional torpedoes, Russia says this behemoth can snoop around enemy defenses to sneak up to enemy coastal cities. Once in position, the huge device would set off its massive nuclear warhead to create large tsunami-like waves, inundating cities and large areas of coastal land with radioactive particles, making the land uninhabitable for decades. The new torpedo and missile are part of Russia's drive to modernize its strategic nuclear arsenal. So, this is a tsunami wave from a nuke. Making the land uninhabitable for decades. So either way, a volcano or a nuke, I believe it would be a nuke. Chernobyl, as it says right here, the meaning of Chernobyl in the Bible is wormwood which could be Iraq, could be this. Just information. Also an IPEC goat. He shows this shark right here is the um, weapon, Russian's weapon right here. And this is what's in IPEC goat, which I have went over this stuff before. In uh We'll see what happens, but the fact of the matter is, with this right here, they expect this, uh, if they set off a nuke, they would probably do it when there was a hurricane by the coast of America. This is coming, this is on Wednesday, this is supposed to be here, this hurricane, off the coast of Africa, a terrible land, as I've showed Bible verses in my other videos, that's supposed to be here on the 21st, right here. So, this is just information. Also, also right here, France recalls its ambassadors from the U.S. over a bunch of BS. Getting out of the United States. Very interesting because I believe that if something happens, 
something happens, they're going to cause it. And then, like I said, here it is right here. And the clock up top here, you can check it out for yourself. It's 12 o'clock midnight, at, just as it is over here on Psalms 23 on the wall. 923, as I said before. 923... Nine twenty-three, as it says on the wall. Feaster Tabernacles. We will see what happens. Lightning right there. Nine twenty-three. Just as that shows an IPEC goat. These days, right here. Like I say, if we're going today, tomorrow, right here tonight, I'm gonna be out tonight. I'm gonna have a short video tonight. I'm gonna be out on my deck tonight who knows we could leave tonight I don't care I'm ready for it but I'm not gonna make a long video about this this information is just information God bless you all